time in practically every young boy's life when he's affected by that wonderful disease of puppy love. I don't mean the kind the boy has for the pretty little girl who lives down the road. I mean it's the real kind. The kind that has four small feet and a wiggly tail and a sharp little teeth that can gnaw on the boy's finger. The kind the boy can rob and play with. Even eat and sleep with. I was 10 years old when I was first affected by that terrible disease. I'm sure no boy in the world had it worse than I did. It's not easy for a young boy to want a dog and not be able to have one. It starts gnawing on your heart. It gets all mixed up in your dreams. It gets worse and worse. That becomes almost unbearable. If my dog wanting a bed that of an ordinary boy, I'm sure my mother and father would have gotten me a puppy. But my wants were different. I didn't want just one dog, I wanted two. And not just any kind of dog, they had to be a special kind and a special breed. I had to have some dogs. I went to my father and had a talk with him. He scratched his head and thought it over. Well, Billy, he said, I heard that old man Hatfield's Carly is going to have pups. I'm sure I could get you one of them. He may as well have just 